If you guys are looking to upgrade your Mutt Squad and are sick of ripping these horrible packs, go over to AOEAH. They deliver your coins fast and they got the cheapest coins in the game. Use code MONTY for 3% off at checkout, boys. What is going on, YouTube? And welcome back to another Madden 25 Ultimate Team video. I am going to be showing you guys all of the ways to get free cards in Mutt 25. Guys, you see my squad. There is free cards everywhere. I didn't really pay for any of them. The only cards that are auctionable on my team is this Coin Quick Sell Teron Armstead. And that is literally it. This Mike Evans and this Matt Stafford are BND. These were, I paid for them in the store. So that is a little bit different. But CMC, free. Christian Watson, free. Puka Nakua, free. Heinz Ward, free. This Luke Musgrave, free. The whole O line, free, except Teron Armstead. And then even on the defensive side of the ball, this 85 Antonio Cromartie, free. I'm going to tell you guys how to get that. Miles Garrett, free. Uh, Max Crosby, free. Jordan Battle, free. BJ Ojulari, free. Divine Diablo, free. Guys, Jabril Peppers, free. Even Damon Clark, free. The whole squad is free, boys. So how exactly do you guys get these cards? I'm going to show you guys how to do it right now. So before we get into this video, be sure to subscribe, smash that like button, and turn on that noti bell, and join the noti nation. Now, if you guys go on college football ultimate team, and you play the ultimate alumni solos, not only will you get some stuff on CFB, but you will also get this free 85 Miles Garrett. You need to collect the first two ultimate alumni tokens. The first one you get from the ultimate alumni welcome pack and you will get a free 85. You need to get 380 overall ultimate alumni players on Madden 25 and put it into that ultimate alumni set. I'll show you guys the set right now. It is this set you see right here. Also reaching level 20 in the college football field pass will get you an XP token. You get 60,000 free XP on Madden 25 for reaching level 20 in the CFB field pass. Now that field pass is down right now. I don't know why there should be two days left. So I wouldn't be surprised if they did add it back in the game for CFB. But like I was saying, ultimate alumni solo challenges, and you get this right here, 380 overall ultimate alumni, and you turn those three into an 85 ultimate alumni champion on Madden 25. And then you also get Madden loyalty packs over on that game as well. Madden 24, you go ahead and literally just log on to Madden 24. I believe I'm almost 100% positive you could still do this and you get this 83 overall Puka or 82 overall Puka Nakua, but he's got 84 speed. So he is pretty solid. Like I said, boys, I'm almost 100% positive. You can still get this Puka Nakua. All you guys got to do is just log on to the game mode. So those are the cards you can get from Madden 24 and CFB 25. Now let's talk about the rest of these free cards, boys. I mean, so many free cards to earn you got this or 82 overall right guard sam cosme you got all of the season one cards you got all of the team captain cards and then you even have the season of boom cards the watson the bj ojalari you have the mutt champs card with the jordan battle and then of course we have the free legend in the antonio cromarty i mean there's a lot to talk about boys so let's get into it i'm gonna start it off with the field passes boys the season one field pass i mean you guys saw how to get that cmc that 85 overall heinz ward what what you guys need to do is level up in the season one field pass every level you will get tickets what you want to spend those tickets on if you go into the store you go over to season tickets you want to buy these upgrade tokens because those season one cards start at an 80 overall so that 85 overall cmc you saw goes from an 80 to an 81 to an 82 to an 83 to an 84 to an 85 and you use these tokens to upgrade it along the way so all you guys need to do is just spend your tickets on these in the store it is totally free all you guys got to do is level up or play solo challenges because i know there is some ways to get it from solos but you know i really don't recommend that way it's really not that fire keep in mind boys you do get some upgrade tokens along the way but really none you only get 181 overall one you get i know you get an 83 overall one and you also get an 82 overall one and that's it so the rest of them you're gonna have to buy with your tickets also like i said that cmc comes from the welcome pack and here are the 80 overall tokens that you gotta put into those sets 
to get those 80 overalls this one right here you get for the first one at level six you can get three 85s from this boys and here are all the 85s you can get the 80 overall cmc you actually get from the welcome pack where these ones you actually have to earn that 80 overall upgrade token and you put that upgrade token into one of these sets like i said you can only get three out of five of these to an 85 overall now we're going to talk about the team captains and the reason we're going to talk about the team captains is because we're going to have these all year round like this these are going to be cars you have in your lineup literally until the end of mutt and i don't know how many exactly but at least one of these will turn into a 99 overall my guess is two of these one on offense or one on defense you know they're going to want us to do that but we could do it on either side of the ball two on each doesn't really matter but you can get these cards upgraded all year long and all you guys got to do is just level up in this field pass and use these tokens on these cards now you choose which player you want i chose the jeff saturday just to have a free center all year round you know that's a fire position to get for free don't gotta buy a center they're usually expensive that's fire so i chose jeff saturday and right now i believe he goes to an 83 overall either an 82 or an 83 overall yeah he is an 83 overall now you can't get all of them to an 83 overall so you guys can see right here you can get one of them to an 83 and another one to an 80 as of right now and as of right now, they only go up to an 83. One thing I want to say is how to level up in these field passes. Guys, just go over to the field passes, go to milestones, go to programs, go to dailies, and just check out all of these objectives. You guys can see there's lots of objectives to earn XP in all of these field passes, mainly the season one field pass. All you guys really got to do is just play games, you know, pretty much head-to-head -head solo seasons and solo battles specifically because that's where all of these objectives track you know there are some that tracks in solo challenges as well but not all of them so putting two season of boom players in your lineup and playing any game mode like i said specific you really want to play head-to-head -head solo seasons or battles but like i said some of them track in solo challenges so put two season of boom players in your lineup and play some game modes and same goes for team captains you really want to put these team captain players in your lineup because you can see right here get team tackles with a team captain player get rushing yards with a team captain player you need them in your lineup so put those two in your lineup season of boom or regular just season one players and these team captains in your lineup and you know i said season of boom season of boom as well man you got to put these players in your lineup as well this is also another way to earn a bunch of free cars put two season of boom players in your lineup and you will track get these stats tracked as you play games so what does this get you i mean guys these boom tokens could possibly get you a free 85 slash 86 overall season of boom player all you guys gotta do is collect all of the boom tokens b-o-o-m and guys, you want to put it into this season of boom set you see right here. You can do this set three times. You can do it two from grinding the solo challenges and the last one from getting all of them from the field pass. So like I said, boys, season of boom is a fire way to get free cards. You get those boom tokens from in here. You get this 76 overall right there. 76 plus overall pack. I've seen people get 85s out of there. Another one. And you get this 83 overall BJ Ojolari. Another 76 plus. Another 76 plus and then a 78 plus at the end now that is just from the field pass let's go over and take a look at solo challenges now i'm gonna start with the season of boom just because we were on that topic like i said you can get those boom tokens as you go and play these solo challenges but you see along the way you get some free 78 pluses 76 pluses and stuff like that like i said guys lots of people are pulling 85s out of here even that 80 plus bnd at the end lots of 85 so make sure you get these season of boom challenges done not only that but if if you get those season of boom challenges done and then you play these challenges you will get a free 83 overall christian watson he's got 85 speed also guys you saw that jabril peppers and that Najee harris i had in my lineup those start at an 80 overall or a 79 overall i forget which but it doesn't really matter you use those upgrade tokens to get this jabril peppers and that Najee harris to an 83 overall here is the Najee harris as well so season of boom challenges bunch of free cards to earn from there let's talk about the legends man i mean if you play literally all of your legend solos right now you may depending on you know what you have done in the last couple of weeks if you did that glitch last week you definitely have enough if you open any bundles you definitely have enough and if you finished the whole legends field pass you definitely have enough obviously you have to do these solos as well but 
If you did any of those and you also did these solos, you probably can get a full legend right now with these legends tokens. All you gotta do is go over to the sets. I will show you the set right now. And you want to put those tokens into this set right here, the 85 to 86 overall BND Legends Champ Token Exchange Fantasy Pack. You get to choose which legend you want. I chose the Antonio Cromartie because he is an OP corner, and we really don't have that many of those. And it, the ones we have are crazy expensive, and he is a really good one. So I said we'll get Antonio Cromartie, but. Like I said, you guys can use those tokens to get any free legend of your choice. It is BND though, but who cares? It's a position you don't need to buy for your squad. And you're not going to just, you know, waste the coins anyway. The majority of the time we waste coins in this game, guys. And it's just a fact. You know, me specifically, I do a lot. But I know you guys out there love ribbon packs too, if we're being honest. Now, moving on. We talked about the legends. We talked about the season of boom and the ultimate boom. Now, the AKA challenges, there's really nothing right now to get. But, you know, in a few weeks, you will get a free AKA champion. But team builders, a free 82 overall team builders BND card. And you can literally choose from 32 over 82 overalls. I chose the Divine Diablo 82 overall middle linebacker with 86 speed. He's a beast. I've used him. He is insane. He lurks balls like crazy. He's a stud. So 82 overall Divine Diablo from there. And Epic Challenges and Forge, I'm not really going to talk about. Now, I just realized those ultimate preseason challenges are no longer in the game. So you can only get this Sam Cosby to a 79 overall. Don't know why they took that out the game already, but yeah, sorry about that, boys. I said it earlier in the video, but honestly, it's really not that crazy. His stats aren't the best anyway. Now we're going to talk about head-to-head. Head-to-head rank, you know, this is really hard. I'm not going to say it is easy like this part of the video, all of the head-to-head -head game modes. If you are a comp player... You know, you want to try this out. You got a good team. You think you're pretty good. You want to earn some free cards. Maybe think these cards are fire. Go ahead. I went 19 and one in champs. That's how I got that 84 overall Jordan battle. Now, yes, I know 19 and one is crazy for an 84 overall, but I'm just putting it out there. This is a free card. This video is how to get free cards and mutt. That is, this is a free card. So I'm just letting you guys know champs. If you guys get, I believe it's 16 wins or 17, you get a free player is 16 wins. You get a free 84 overall of your choice in the gauntlet. You get a free 86 overall of your choice. I believe, I don't know if you get the sweat or if you get a player of your choice, I'm forgetting because there is so much to remember with both games coming right now, but head to head ranked. If you guys finish at a certain rank, you get a fire card. Now I'm going to take away my camera for a second. You can see if you finish in tier 100, you get that 89 overall Ed Reed. Tier 2, Kyle Pitts. Tier 3, you guys see it goes down in the list. But those are a bunch of fire cards. Now, I'm in gold tier 1, so I'm going to get this 84 overall Amani. But I'm trying to get to, you know, maybe Ed Reed or at least Kyle Pitts. I'm going to sweat up before this season ends, boys. And if I were you, I would too, because it's not as hard as you think if you have a good squad. But boys, those are pretty much all the ways to get free players in the game. Obviously not including, you know, free packs and stuff like that. You pretty much get free packs and coins from like every game mode. If you really think about it, like literally every game mode, except play a friend and uh, practice, you know, challenges, you're going to get free cards, players, packs, coins, same with solo seasons, same with solo battles. And same with head to head now like i said you're not gonna be getting actual free cards from like some of these but like packs will give you cards like solo season solo battles is basically what i'm talking about there but that is pretty much it for this video if you guys enjoyed thank you for watching peace out